Hi guys, Max Powers here again. Uh, I'm going to do the review on the MK808. Finally got it from uh, China. Um, mini T TV for Android, dual core A9 processor. Again, this is the MK808. It's running the Rockchip RK3066 uh, Cortex A9 processor, and this thing's fast. It, it smokes. It's a lot faster than uh, than previous mini PCs, um, especially the UG802, uh, which I just returned due to the Wi-Fi issue. Um, more of that, you can see that in my uh, in my other um, review of the uh, UG802. Um, here the uh, MK808 is running Android 4.1 Jelly Bean, uh, which was surprising. I thought it was coming with Ice Cream Sandwich, but it is in fact uh, Jelly Bean. Um, same HDMI output, although it is a um, a female mini HDMI uh, receptacle off of the off the unit itself instead of the uh, the full size male HDMI. That was um, kind of a weird uh, design. So I think it's that's. Quite a bit improved. We do not. We don't have any type of uh, aftermarket launcher or any blur, or anything like that. This is um, uh, Jelly Bean in the raw, um, so it looks really good and, and it runs really fast. Um, as far as memory goes, it does have one gig of DDR3 uh, RAM um, flash memory on board. It has eight gigs of a NAND flash. Um, the Wi-Fi which is a vast improvement from previous models. It is an 802.11BG um, band um, Wi-Fi card. It, it does have a dual cards inside, and uh, it works great. Um, my router's up in my office, and I, I run this thing on my, on my main TV downstairs, which is pretty far away, and it has full bars. Um, so very good. Uh, good job. They've improved that. Um... Other than that, it is your um, your your Android experience here. Um, I have installed a couple apps. Let's just jump right into them right here. Here's one uh, IP Cam Viewer. That's the uh, front of my house there, live. Um, <clears throat> I do have connected to it um, two USBs um, right now, just for the video. This is the um, Air Mouse. That I use on my couch that uh, works very well. I almost returned this um, when I had the UG802. I, I thought it was the uh, the uh, air mouse problem, but it wasn't. It was the actual device. I don't know if it was underpowered or what, but the range was about three feet on it, and now I can sit about ten feet back with this air mouse in it, and it works great. Um, I also have um, just standard Logitech um, wireless mouse hooked up to it too. Um, while I'm sitting here. So, uh, everything on here works great. Um, we can go, you know, I've got, I've got Facebook loaded. Everything, you know, loads really fast. Um, left click um, to select and right click to go back. Um, Netflix works w really well. Um, it's uh, just what you'd expect to see um, from a uh, if you're watching on your PC or, or like a Roku player or, or anything like that. So I'm going to exit that. Uh, it does have the, uh, the Play Store. It uh, comes preloaded and um, works really well. I'm, I'm extremely happy with this. I was very disappointed on, uh, on the UG802. Um, and uh, this is a dramatic improvement. So it does come preloaded with Chrome, which is which is kind of cool. I thought it does have a fire uh, file explorer, um, a couple other stock ones you may or not may or may not use, but you can uh, remove pretty much any one of these. Um, but as far as speed, it, it's there. Uh, as you can see, my screen is a little uh, stretched here. Um, I don't have that problem when it's connected to my TV, but uh, that's fixed really easy with the uh, so screen zoom options. Back it up one. Yeah, uh, good to go. Um, YouTube works really well. Um, although uh, Flash, um, you you may or not know that Flash not supported by Jelly Bean uh, 4.1, so it was um, it didn't work uh, with the Dolphin browser, and um, there was no Flash. You go to a Flash website, it would not play Flash at all. 
um, which uh, which was a problem. But you can go to Adobe's website. Um, I will post a link to the late um, the previous version of Flash that you can load on here. Um, but again, it won't work with Dolphin browser. It will work with the stock browser. So then again, um, you will have Flash support with the stock browser. So, but all in all, I think this is a uh, this is a winner for the mini PC. It took them a couple to get it right, but uh, but this is great. I have it connected to my TV downstairs, and um, it it's it makes it more than a smart TV. Uh, I you know I run torrents, I run Netflix. Um, you know, I've got 32 gig memory, um, mini SD card in there, which, which is plenty. So uh, this is it. This is the one to get, guys. So um, let me know if you have any questions. You want me to do any more uh, review on it, and um, and I'll I'll get that done for you. So once again, Max Powers. Uh, thanks for watching.